And joining us now is Evan Griffin. He's one of the owners and operator of EC Property Homes LLC here in Baltimore. Thanks for joining us, Evan. I appreciate it, man. Jason, thank you. It's great to be on. Listen, you're in the segment uh, Positively Baltimore. One thing positive that you've done, but also took some risk. You started a business during the pandemic, but then as you got gone, you reached out to help first responders uh, with who are dealing with COVID. Tell me a little bit about both. Yeah, definitely. That you know that became part of the business that was very unexpected, but I was really glad, glad to accommodate. Uh, you know, home ownership always had been a, a, a goal of mine. Uh, and when we moved to the area, I sort of took advantage of that uh, with Baltimore and some of the state-run programs, uh, working with the DCHD, and was able to uh, buy a property in, in the downtown Baltimore area. And, you know, there was so much buzz about uh, Airbnb, uh, decided to see what it was about, and it turned out to be a great opportunity. And one of the big things I heard about was a lot of the hosts and a lot of the other landlords in the area didn't look like me. And so I was able to work and do business with people from Baltimore that looked like me and also were coming to Baltimore during the pandemic, being first responders, you know, doing uh, giving out vaccines. And it was actually a, a, a great opportunity to be involved in the community and help out. And part of helping out, and for so that people know, what you do is you go in and you invest in properties, fix them up, and the hope is to sell them. And you want also the community to learn from what you're doing. Maybe teach them about investing uh, into houses or whatever they may want to invest in. Why is that important, do you think, to start this young generation to understand about investment, especially in properties? Yeah, well, you know, they say that the uh, home ownership in the black community is down to 41% versus 73% in other communities. And it's a lack of information. Um, you know, the process, uh, you need someone to, to go in there and sort of help people through the steps and understand the magnifying glass that they put on you when it comes to the mortgage process. And, you know, um, I, I went through the process and was able to, you know, streamline the process to help and be an example to know that, hey, this is something that can be done uh, it's something that's attainable, attainable uh, it's something that's important. Uh, you know, home ownership is the, and real estate is the number one uh, generational wealth builder uh, in the world. And it, it helps to understand that. I mean, these areas around us uh, are our communities. So why not own part of our community? Yeah, and I was going to say, I'll get you to talk a little bit more about that, because some people may see that ownership or that mortgage is just another bill. But it's not about mm -hmm. just today. It's about the years mm -hmm. ahead of there. Yeah, 100 percent. You know, um, one thing I found out about the real estate process is it's, it's like running a business. I mean, the way you keep your home, uh, you know, the way you do your repairs. Mm -hmm. And the last part that I realized is how much you inspire, you know, the people around you from your neighbors uh, and to other people. Uh, like you. I mean, I said earlier, one of the things that uh, I didn't expect to get from people who were looking for places to rent or people who were looking to stay at Airbnb was, you know, I've never seen anyone that uh, looks like you as yeah. a landlord or at, even as an Airbnb host. And, you know, the Airbnb is everywhere. So we're building a community and we're inspiring people to say like, hey, this is attainable and I can do this and, and start the generational wealth because real estate is the number one generational wealth builder in the world. Hey, real quick, if anyone wants to find you or learn more about how to get involved, uh, what's a good place to, to look for you? Uh, well, listen, if you're in the downtown area, please stop by the Lombard Loft Airbnb and say hi. Uh, right now, we're uh, working on our YouTube page, so you can find us at the Lombard Loft uh, at YouTube and then Instagram, the Lombard Loft. All right. That's Evan Griffin. He is one of the owners over there at EC Property Homes, LLC. Thank you for the time, sir. Thank you, Jason. Certainly.